Alright guys, it's Tuesday. You know what that means. It's eBay experiment day. So today we're <laughs> we got a lot to cover. Cause it's been a busy, 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 busy weekend. So guys, don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, give us a follow or a subscribe because uh we're really, really close at 3,000 mark. We could potentially be at that 3,000 mark by the time this video comes out. So anyways, let's get into it. Let's see what we have in the store right now. And then we'll talk about what sold this week. Cause like I said, it's been busy. So we're coming over here. Of course, we got the usual suspects, Michael Jordan. We got Geralt, uh, the Witcher. And of course, the some of the ones that I got, I can't remember which mystery box. We got some from, uh, Last week that relisted, so of course the Javar, the deceased. Um, like I said, this fairy tale one, yeah, he he's probably gonna list for a while. Um, Tokyo Ghoul, we got uh, the two pack of the Spider Man. Um, I'm really thinking about pulling down all the black lights and just bundling them all together. Um, all this stuff, like I said, just just relisted. Um, I had some interest in this Tanjiro. Um, I told the lady that messaged me about him. There's, there, there's, I hate saying there's no damage and then sending it out to the individual and then being like, there's damage, you lied, you know, if that makes any sense. And like I told him, I was like, I'll take additional photos and send them to you, but I'm not going to say there's no damage because that's the last thing I want is to have that in writing and then be like, oh, what the hell, man? You know what I mean? Um, of course, I dropped the Kakashi 2-pack just a little bit. Um, I dropped uh, the price of the uh, Trolls 2-pack just a little bit. I think it was like 2 bucks. I dropped it. So we've dropped it, I think, a total of like $12 since I listed it back a couple months ago. Um, Rat Fink, I, I dropped it like 2 bucks because I have three of the Rat Fink. I, I legit don't know how I'm going to get rid of the Rat Fink. Um, like I said, most of this stuff just, just relisted. So a lot of this doesn't have views, but I know quite a few of these were actually getting views and people wanting to actually, uh, buy them. Um, I'm going to have to remove one of these. We're going to end that listing because I don't know why, for some reason it listed it twice. Um, the other one I'm really thinking about doing is pulling down the venomized pops as well. If I pull down the venomized pops and group them together like the black lights, I think they might actually sell. I'm not sure. Um, back up and listed right now, we got the Darth Revenant figure with uh, the two Gokus, which the buyer like bid it on it and then just never paid for it. And whenever I reach out to him, there was a zero response. Um, the Demon Slayer, um, Saname, I had one person that offered me like five bucks for it. So like I said, I'm willing to go to 15, but nothing really under that. Cause I need to attempt to make my money back on that. Um, I dropped the price on the, uh, four pack of Star Wars pops right here. Like I said, Star Star Wars pops, they, unless you got the OG OGs, they don't hold value they are way 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 overproduced and to me they're just kind of plain like especially if you look at this like if you look they all look the same they're just some guy in a helmet with a different color like it, i don't know that's just me um the funko sodas like this freddy funko keeps getting looks but never budges um surprisingly the uh the the standard Darkwing duck gets a lot of views gets a lot of attention and like i said for nine dollars i'm taking an l on that one and uh that's the floor where i'm at with that um the my hero academia a lot um i have it listed at 110 i'm willing to let it go for 100 i know i had one person earlier offer i think it was like 60 and it's like bro like nah i'm good um, so it looks like we're getting towards the ones that are getting ready to relist. Um, I would not be surprised if this killer B stays in the lot a lot longer, if that makes sense. I may have to drop him down to 10 bucks. And like I said, I'm really debating if I want to pull all the black light pops 
pull them down, list them together as a lot, and sell them just like the Venomize. Because like I got a Venomize Storm. There's a whole bunch of Venomize pops that I have that um, I can potentially like like I said bundle together, let them go. Same with the black lights, and then of course I got the uh, my hero one. So anyways, let's go full face cam, bam. And let's talk about sold listings. It sucks because I can't show the sold listing page because it shows like people's addresses and stuff. Um, so we were able to sell the Dragon Ball Z uh, Future Trunks Hot Topic bundle for 25, which is what I listed it for. We sold the Moana, Pua, and Hai Hai. It sold for $25, what I had it listed for. The Grumpy Seven Doors, $15, what I listed it for. Basically, all these sold for what I listed it for. Uh, Wally, $15, sold what I listed it for. And I think, like I said, I got another two I'm getting ready to list for that. And then, of course, Homer, Jack in the Box, sold for $20, which is pretty decent. Considering PPG, I think PPG right now says that that pops worth like $40. Bucks. And that one hasn't moved. And then... Oh, the last one that sold this week was the Miguel with guitar. The, um, com well, I think it is a shared sticker. That one actually sold for 20. So we actually sold one, two, three, six right now. And then I think there's like another three that have bids. So it's been a busy, busy week. And, um, yeah, so let's get into what we're going to list this week for sale. And let's see, uh, let's see if you guys like it. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe. I'll leave a link down in my comment section to my eBay store. Go check that out. And uh, let's get into it. All right, so uh, I couldn't record out in the living room. I'm kind of busy doing stuff out there, so it's kind of loud. So as of right now, we're going to be able to check and see what we have listed this week in the eBay store. We're going to do it right off the page. So here we go. First one's first is going to be the Energizer Bunny. This one's pretty cool. I think this one came out in like 2017 or 18. Uh, 19 actually. It's a flocked one. And come find out, this one actually has a variant from GameStop. This one is actually from the Funko store. And I have it, as you can tell, listed for $20 plus shipping. I'm willing to be flexible. Um, you know, you can throw me an offer like 12 bucks. I'll probably end up taking it. Followed by the next one is going to be the Michael Jordan in his uh, Chicago Bull sweats. This one has a special edition sticker. I'm not exactly sure. This one might be Foot Locker exclusive originally. I can't exactly remember. It's in really good shape. I got it months and months and months ago. This is all on the protector. I probably should have cleaned that up. And um, yeah, it's just never left the uh, the case here. It was made 2020. So surprisingly, that's coming up on a three-year-old pop. Actually, 629, 2020. So in a month, it'll be actually three years old. Followed by a, two big lots. We got two big lots here. Let's check it out. The first big lot we got, we got an Ahsoka lot. And I mean an Ahsoka lot. And this one I don't understand, right? Because it was an LA Comic-Con exclusive, right? And it has a special edition sticker slapped on there. So I don't get it. Um, this one was actually originally a Hot Topic exclusive. And with the Ahsoka show coming out here really soon, like these ones, you should definitely add to your collection. This top one was actually a, I think it's an Amazon exclusive, but the two bottom Rebel ones, like I said, this is a LA Comic-Con exclusive. And this is just the Hot Topic. These are in really, really good shape. I know when I was looking at it, the LA Comic Con um, exclusive one, which I can't tell what the DRM on those are. I can't see. Anyways, um, both of, like both of these two on the bottom never left their protectors. I've had them the whole time. And this one, like it was in a protector and then I took it out of the protector because for whatever reason, this Amazon exclusive one has just taken a nosedive. And I mean a nosedive in value, but if you guys are looking for a really good value, 120, pick up these three Ahsoka pops. Like I said, this LA Comic Con one usually sells for about 80 bucks. This one sells usually around 40. So you're looking at 120 right there. So basically I'm throwing in the Amazon exclusive one for free jump on it followed by this one which 
I should probably wait until Halloween because I think these would probably sell way faster and way higher at Halloween time. But we got Louie, I mean Huey, Louie, and Dewey from DuckTales, right? So of course you got Scrooge McDuck's uh, nephews all dressed up. So of course Louie has the pumpkin on his head. He's dressed up like a ghost. You got Huey dressed up as the devil and Dewey dressed up as like a witch, warlock, I guess you can say. These ones are really cool. I've had these ones in my collection for a while now. And for whatever reason, they just don't fit in my collection. I don't really have any real need for them. They came out, look, 2019. I think that's what it says. Yeah, 19. I think that's what that means. I can't really tell. I'll have to pull them out and look. But these ones, you can usually find them separate. For whatever reason, people love to sell these ones separate instead of together. And I'm telling you right now, this was a hell of a deal. 120 for all three Huey, Louie, and Dewey. And look, 125, 110. You get two for 60 right there, 130, 115. So I'm selling right smack dab in the middle. It's a great buy. Jump on it. Um, hopefully, you guys like this format more than the normal format. Um, like I said, I couldn't film out in my kitchen because it's kind of loud out there right now. So it is what it is. But this this way, I can actually sit here, talk to you guys, and kind of hype up these pops. Uh, don't forget, go check out the link down in the description. We're going to have a link to my eBay, a link to my Discord. Come hang out with me because guess what? We've been playing the living hell out of that uh was it the marvel spider-man game over on the stream on top of that you can go check out videos of my dogs you can check out you know episodic videos if you don't feel like sitting down and watching a three-hour stream with me you can go and sit down and watch you know 15 20 minute long video that basically sums up portions of the stream and like i said i'm trying to break them down into episodic you know adventures with me but until next time you guys take it easy don't forget like comment subscribe bye